Hello all you wonderful people, welcome back to the channel. Three cheers, four drinks, sip sip, hooray. And today, we're making the Whiskey Smash. Keep watching, and we're gonna show you how to make it. I know this might sound crazy, but I'm not necessarily a whiskey drinker. I know, I know, but hear me out. When I have a drink, I tend to reach for the gin, the rum, the tequila, all those lighter spirits. But just the other day, I was thinking, you know what? I kinda wanna have a drink that has that nice warmth, weight, depth, full body that whiskey has. So I was doing a little research, searching on the Google, what whiskey drink should I make? And I came across the Whiskey Smash, and I thought, this would be pretty tasty, pretty refreshing, and will satisfy that craving that I've had for whiskey. So I decided to give it a shot. And oh boy, am I glad that I did, because it is so delicious, nice and balanced, refreshing, full body drink. Whether you're a whiskey chick or you get a whiskey kick, I really think you should try this drink. And trust me, you will not be disappointed. So now we're gonna get into the Whiskey Smash. Okay, so getting into the drink. The Whiskey Smash, a couple ingredients, real simple. We got our whiskey, we got our simple syrup, we have lemon, and we have mint. Easy enough, right? There's just, no, there's no reason not to try it. So first thing we're gonna do is cut up our lemon. So I got one lemon right here, one half just as such. I'm gonna cut this bad boy in half, quarter it off just like this. So we got six lemon pieces here and they're gonna go straight into our glass. We've got a short glass for this drink and we're gonna serve this over ice. Lemon into the glass, boom. Get rid of this guy over here. Now you might be wondering, why do I have a potato masher? And that's because I don't have a muddler. So what we're gonna be doing with this is just using this end of the masher to just crush up the lemons or smash the lemons. <laughs> so we're gonna go ahead and do that. So what we're doing here is crushing up the lemons, extracting that juice, as well as getting a little bit of the oils from the lemon peel into the liquid. It gives it just that little tartness, little bitters that you get from the peel typically. You want to be pretty aggressive with this. Really make sure you're getting all the oils out of the lemon, all the juice out of the lemon. Okay, it's looking good there. Next thing we're going to grab is our mint. So I have about eight little mint leaves here. Just going to kind of roll them up just a little, put them in there and just very lightly you're gonna take your potato masher or your muddler, very gently push down on that mint. You don't wanna bruise the mint, you really just wanna push it enough so that all the oils release, you get that mint scent coming off from the glass. Important not to over muddle the mint. So I'm happy with that. We're gonna let this chill up for just a second here. And now we're gonna combine our whiskey and our simple syrup into our shaker. So starting off simple syrup, one to one ratio of water to sugar. I have one ounce of this, this is going into the glass. Next up, I have my whiskey, Weiser's whiskey, local stuff, right down the street from us. I'm gonna add two ounces of this into our shaker. Perfect. Ice into the shaker. We're actually gonna roll the ice from the shaker into our glass, so we're not gonna add any ice into the glass right away, it's just gonna come straight from the shaker. So, we're gonna shake this up. Nice and quick. A little shake and then here we go straight from the shaker into the glass we want some of that ice to come out there more so now we're just going to strain the rest out and then finally we have a little garnish of mint here but a nice little nice little mint bouquet and there it is the whiskey smash how easy is it i'm gonna give it a shot So the first thing you notice, of course the whiskey comes through, it gives it that depth, that flavor, that really rich whiskey weight, that whiskey warmth that you're looking for in a drink. But it's nice and rounded off by the simple syrup, the aromatics from the mint. It's a really nice balanced drink. If you're a whiskey lover, or you don't tend to typically reach for the whiskey, you're going to love this drink. Super simple to make, and with Father's Day right around the corner, there's no better excuse to make this drink. Super simple, dad's going to love it. That will probably ask for a couple. He'll probably ask for like four or five. I don't know. So please, please try this drink. The Whiskey Smash. Speaking of smash, you should smash that like button, smash that subscribe button, so we know that you're enjoying these videos. Cheers! You want to be pretty aggressive. <laughs> but not that aggressive. <laughs> 